the bar, off the bar, off the bar, off the bar. I'm too persistent. Whipping cold, man, no cash. Get it on my own, no collab. Hey, today's your lucky day with Miyagi and Andy Panda Hajime, but this one was requested by um, Fedor. But we also got two, four, five, oh no, only four, four different tracks that I'm reacting to, all different requests and that, blood. So I'm dropping them one by one, you know, aim, blood. So uh, yeah, let's get into this. I don't know why I haven't reacted to this, because this is literally the label name, so... Yeah, exactly. I was literally just going to say, it makes a lot of sense. This is going to be like all the way back in time on like how this started or whatever, but already I don't even need to like listen to anything. You can already tell that Hajime, that's the name of the, um, the label and that. So I'm guessing this is going to be a story about how basically everything started. Probably even like they might even go as further back as how they met each other and how they, you know, I'm saying got into this music thing and that, but then you got the cassette tape effect because that kind of shows like old school type of thing, bro. You know what I mean? Wax on, wax off. Ooh, the little wait a minute. Was that them? Wait, wait, wait. Nah, 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 nah. This might be them as they're like, as they're older, actually. Because I was going to say, this might be them when they're younger, but I feel like this is them at the same age. Because Andy Panda had on the same t shirt. You know what I mean? Yeah, I feel like this was like, you know, like when artists start off blood, like the, all they want to do is just music, music, music. They want to rap, they want to show their talent. So I feel like this was still in a certain time where these guys were more so concentrating on the rap side of things. They're probably still very artistic and very talented, but I feel like now the way they, like every single time they release the track and that, it's like a, it's like a, a musical, like you're not in, it's like a musical percussion type of vibe. Like Miyagi's using his voice, he's doing all these different kinds of sounds and vocals and you know I am that he's not just rapping. I feel like at this point they're probably just concentrated on just the bars, rapping flows, bro. You know what I mean? Even in terms of the audio, not the audio, in terms of the visuals and that, because if you guys remember the album trailer that they released, how artistic that was, how they were using different kind of cultures and metaphors visually to like explain what they were doing. And here's just him and man like Andy Panda and that bro, you know, same with the camera, man. You know, aimed at because you got to utilize what you have and that. Some people might not be the richest when they start off and that, but the videos still have a certain level of like authenticity about them and that, bro. You know, aimed at just him and Andy Panda vibing, man. You get me? <laughs> That's the first ever time I've seen a woman shake anything in a Miyagi Andy Panda video, bro. That's crazy, bro. Let's rewind it for the one time. And that's what I mean as well. Like here, it's more so just about the hip hop, man. You know, and hey, now they do so many different kind of sounds, and you can't really put them in a box. But I feel like at this time. I'm also just concentrating on hip hop and that man, you know, and rapping the hearts out. Yeah, I feel like 
свое на банда принимает так, что вам вместо мало, нам вместо нала была бы мана, душа растамана, как волчьего клана, так больше не надо, ты вроде мадама, здравое тело, но грязи и хлама, пуст дамблдор дал бы нам мотор, я сделал магию хип-хоп террор, но твор буров лес мой хом, я прячу эти мысли, хавай хардкор, по полкам слоты, короли воеводы, лепим этот став, пока дымят заводы. На волне And I'm guessing every single time they reference a certain random visual is referencing what they're saying. When you see Andy Panda, sometimes write his name in regular English and sometimes he does it in Russian and that, bro. You know what I mean? I wonder what influences that. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Your boy and Jazz. And I'm out of here. No big people, man.